let's go to the first exercise question 12 a can do a piece of work in 7 days working 9 hours each day b can do the work in 6 days working 7 hours each day so i can say a can do the piece of work in 63 hours 7 days 9 hours each day so that is 63 hours similarly b can do the same piece of work in 6 days or 7 hours so he can do the work in 42 hours how long will they take to do it working together 8.4 hours a day okay okay so in how many hours will a plus b working together finish the work it will be a into b upon a plus b so if a does the work in a hours and b does the work in b hours the time taken by a plus b working together will be a into b upon a plus b which is nothing but 63 into 42 upon 63 plus 42 which is equal to 63 into 42 upon 105 so many hours so in how many days will that mean obviously the total time taken by a plus b that should be divided by 8.4 so it is 63 into 42 upon 105 into 1 upon 8.4 now this is an important step from your point of view the common mistake which is committed by students is they will calculate this exactly let's say this is equal to 63 into 42 upon 105 as 7 into 15 so 7 into 9 3 5s are 15 3 is a 9 which is equal to uh, 42 into 3 is 126 upon 5 which is equal to 252 upon 10 which is equal to 25.2 hours most of the students will do it this way they'll calculate the time taken by both of them to finish the same piece of work is 25.2 hours since the time taken is 25.2 hours and they will be working 8.4 hours per day so upon 8.4 which is equal to 252 upon 84 which is equal to 84 into 3 3 days now this is the normal way of doing it but please remember when you are doing this you are doing two calculations one you are calculating this completely second you are dividing by 8.4 it is always advantageous to cut the calculation effort and do it this way which means you don't calculate this complete value you don't calculate 25.2 because you know this data will be required later on so you are better of writing it like this 63 into 42 upon 105 into 1 upon 8.4 is nothing but 10 by 84 okay. so 41 42 2 84 2 1 2 2 5 10 10 so this is 21 21 into 3 63 which is equal to 3 days so my advice would always be if you need a subsequent calculation is required to get to the answer don't complete the first calculation this should be left as it is and then divide by 8.4 to get to the answer the correct answer is 3 days